Hello everyone, how are things with you? I hope things are spectacular. This is Rohini, welcome back to my channel, Life and English with Rohini. In today's video, I'm going to teach you present continuous tense. Watch this video till end. I am sure that the information that I'm going to share with you about present continuous tense is definitely going to help you. So let's get started. So what is present continuous tense? Present continuous tense is used to narrate the actions that are happening right now. And present continuous tense is used to narrate actions that are happening in the near future. Let us see the sentence formations. But before that, let us see the usage of be verb in the sentences. Be verbs used with respective subjects. Am is used with I, are is used with you, they, we, is is used with he, she, name and it. Add ing to the main verb to show that the action is continuing. For instance, meditate, meditating, cook, cooking, read, reading, participate, participating, talk, talking, give, giving. Now these are some of the example sentences. The first sentence is affirmative, second is negative, and the third is interrogative. So, I am meditating. I am not meditating is negative. An interrogative is, am I meditating? Well, we don't ask ourselves that am I meditating, but to understand the grammatical structure, we're using this kind of an interrogation sentence. Next is, she is cooking. Negative, she is not cooking. Interrogative, is she cooking? He is talking to them about his new business venture. He is not talking to them about his new business venture. Is he talking to them about the new business venture? They are participating in the event. They are not participating in the event. Are they participating in the event? We all are reading the same email. We all are not reading the same email. Are we all reading the same email? You are giving all the documents. You're not giving all the documents. Are you giving all the documents? Now let us see a few more examples of the actions happening in the near future. Present continuous tense, actions happening in the near future. Example number one, he is joining the class tomorrow. They are meeting him next week. She is visiting the city next month. I'm making sandwiches tonight. You're placing an order in 10 minutes. Those who are new to my channel, please consider subscribing. I promise you that the information and knowledge that I share in these videos will definitely be helpful to you guys. And those who are existing subscribers, I'm grateful to you guys. Do watch this video, like and share and help me grow and help this channel to grow in leaps and bounds. That's all for today. See you around in my next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.